This episode, why, okay, y'all, watching it back, it was just really hilarious because um, I was trying to figure out why Lady Glitter Sparkles was crying so much. Like, she just wouldn't shut up. Like, me, I am the ultimate crybaby, but that that girl, she beat me because she just was crying too fucking much. Um, I, I just I just really didn't understand it. I don't know what the fuck. I seen Cash I posted a fucking picture today on her um story and it was clock it. It was lo- it was it was it was something Lady Glitter Sparkles had in her ass. And I wanna play a game with y'all. And the game that I'm gonna play with y'all is called What Is This? So I want y'all to put in the comments what the fuck you thought that was. Like, what the fuck was that? Like, I don't know what it was. So these are the options that I'm giving y'all. These are the options. So y'all put y'all options there and y'all tell me what y'all think that is. Like balls, extra meat, I don't know. I really, I really don't know what the fuck that was. Um, but she, Lady Glitter Sparkles, she's definitely an actress. Can I get in the studio? Can we clap one time? She deserves an Oscar. That bitch deserves an Oscar. Like, she really deserves a motherfucking Oscar because this bitch is faking. You're faking. You're faking. You're faking. You're faking. You're faking. You're faking. Like, you're not that mad. You're not that mad. Like, nothing even happens to you yet. But you're not that mad. Like, you're just doing too much. Then the bitch want to run around the house talking about some, you're not no superstar. Okay. Bitch, I didn't tell you I was a superstar. Like, what the fuck is you talking about? Like, that's just some hater shit. Just like in the last episode, she talking about some, I'm the rapper now. I'm the rapper now. I'm the rapper now. Like, what is that about? I don't, I don't understand it. I don't get it. Okay, yeah, I do music, but I do a lot of other things too. You can be the rapper, bitch. I can do other things. If that's what you're mad about. Are, are you mad? Like, what's, what's really the real issue? Because it's, it's not making no sense to me. Then, oh, in the, in the episode before that, Liddy, if you want this fade, bitch, come and get it. Like, bitch, I said that. that I said that. Like, why don't you come up with something else? Like, bitch, come here. Let me blow this dust at you. <sighs> like, come with something like that. Or how about, um, yeah, if you want this fade, I got glitter in my butt. Ooh. If you want this fade, I got glitter in my butt. That's a million dollars. You better take that, bitch. If you want this fade, I got glitter in my butt. That's what you say, bitch. Don't say my shit. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Don't say my shit. Um, and first of all, let me clear another thing up. Because I'm the only motherfucking spider woman ninja around this bitch on South Central Baddies. Just like I'm the first female rapper to freestyle into a fade and on the network. Just like I am the first one to jump a motherfucking balcony. I, look, maybe Isaiah had it mixed up, but her big ass didn't jump over nothing. She didn't jump over nothing. If you see that window, when, when Pressure was looking for her Gucci purse, clock it. When Pressure was looking for her Gucci purse, you could see her, like, stepping over the motherfucking window. Because it's, it's a lot of people, I've been paying attention to social media, and it's just a lot of people confused, like, dang, how, how she jump off the uh, balcony? Like, how she do that? How, how she do that? Like, really, how did she do that? She didn't do it. She didn't do that shit. Uh-uh. She didn't do it. It it never happened. It never happened. She didn't do nothing. She ran her big ass around the house because the house is like a hill, y'all. So it's upstairs, downstairs, but it's on a hill. So she waddled her ass up the hill, and then when she waddled her ass up the hill, she squeezed her big ass into chili pepper. Well, there is a recipe, okay? There, there is a recipe for the pressure potion, and the recipe for the pressure potion, it is not mace. Y'all did, you know, y'all see mace in my hand, but 
But we, we're like, you know, we're like chefs. Like, you know, so we went in the kitchen and, you know, we, we cooked up a pressure potion, like, you know, with all natural herbs. It was all natural herbs, all natural herbs and hot, 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 hot. <clears throat> real hot, like, you know, but it was no sparkles though. It wasn't no sparkles. It wasn't no, whew. wasn't nothing that can cut somebody's eye. Very digestible, you know? And that bitch is faking anyway, y'all. First of all, somebody told me, and see, I'm a real bitch. I'm not gonna say this person's name because I talked to this person. I did talk, I had a conversation with this person and this person told me that because I asked them, I said, who told you that I put Mason Lolly's drink? I didn't do that. And she was like, oh, it was security. Now that y'all told me who y'all think Gigi is, I have a contest, you feel me? Shout out to the sponsor, Swag Boutique. And I actually have, like I said, I have their stuff on today, but you know, I should have got a large because the ass is assing, baby. Yeah, yeah, I've been doing that. So um, the contest is basically, I need you guys to caption this. Okay, I need you guys to caption this. Use the hashtag Swag Boutique, and that is what two O's, two O's and two G's, Swag Boutique. I'm going to pin it in the comments when I get off live. And I need y'all to make a post and caption this. Caption what you think this is for a chance to get a $200 giveaway card. This is a card, a gift card, a $200 gift card to Swag Boutique. And you will be able to shop online. If you're on the west side, you're on the west coast, come inside. And you feel me? Like, get your swag on. Get your swag on. Caption this. Caption this, okay? Caption that. I think it's extra me. But y'all go ahead and caption that, okay? Caption that. Caption that. Caption that. Now, um, Billy, Billy, Billy. Like, I don't know. Mm -mm. Um, I guess she feel like she did her big one or whatever. Um, yeah, like... I don't know, I just, it's obvious, like, I'm biased to the situation. I don't really like her, but I liked her. But when she got on the internet trying to troll me in comments talking about I'm a punk bitch, I, bitch, you was right there when I called these bitches out. You didn't want it either. Now, all of a sudden, you want it. Nobody's scared of her. Like, I just feel like I should get paid more. And motherfuckers is haters. Like, my petition to get Billy off of the fucking show was at 48K signatures, and then you motherfuckers gonna report it. Like, that's some hater ass shit. I want more money. Get this big bitch off the show. But I'm gonna be starting another petition, you guys. All of you guys that signed, please sign again. Please, please, because I don't know when the fuck this reunion is coming. And yeah, I need a big Bitcoin. Like, this is for me to get a pay raise. Like, I need a big Bitcoin. Or just get this bitch off the show. Like, bye. That was not spit on my face. That was milk. And what happened was, I was telling, I was telling, uh, I was telling one of the production people, like, hey, like they like stay in your room. I'm like, I need my vape. Like, I need my vape. Like, y'all keep telling me to stay in this room because I had already got upset because I told them I was like, no, fuck that. Like, y'all need to let me and these bitches fight one on one. Like, y'all need to let me and these bitches fight one on one. Like. Take some of them downstairs, put them in their rooms like cage, like you know, like in, like animals, and then bring me one at a time. Because I told them, I, whoever want to fight me, I'll fight them. But I'm not about to give them the opportunity to jump me because I already felt like I got jumped just a few days ago. So I asked production. I'm not gonna say no names. I'm not into that. But I asked, and they was like, No, we can't control it if they jump you. Oh, I felt like I don't know. That's just how I feel. Like I'm gonna keep it real. Like I felt like. I felt like, you feel me, some powers here wanted me to get jumped because I couldn't get the bitches one at a time. Or maybe it was because they was just too uncontrollable, so you say. Maybe that's what it was. I don't know. Um, so them picking that lock to go into their room, it goes crazy. Um, 
I actually, like, I was just waking up and I heard the commotion and I pushed the dresser behind the door. Uh uh. Hell no. Nah. I didn't know what the fuck was going on. All I heard was something about the door getting kicked down. So before I stepped out the room, I thought bitches were kicking down doors. I'm like, damn, these bitches is, these bitches is kicking down doors? Oh, okay. Like, and I was laughing when I seen that scene with them picking shit up because I was doing the same shit in my room. I was looking for weapons too. I ain't gonna lie, a bitch felt like I was in jail once again. Like, I felt like I was in jail. I was in my room behind that door looking for weapons. Like, if anybody would have came through that room at that time, they was for sure getting hit with something. We were not fighting. Like, no, hands sore and all that. You're getting whacked with something. Like, no, when I told Sway that shit, like, yeah, you let these bitches in this room, if they would have let them bitches in my room, everybody was getting hit with something. Everybody, and I mean the dresser, the door, glass from the window, the doorknob, the ceiling fan, everything. Like, bitch, I would have threw a toilet at one of them bitches. Like, swear to God. Um, 